Aquarius, welcome to Collectively Chosen. It's Miss Kelly coming to you with your weekly reading. It's going to be yours for this week. Okay, we might go into, because I'm thinking about doing them every two weeks. So, if I do them every two weeks, I plan on trying to dedicate at least an hour to your reading. So, that way you can get, like, your good stuff. You can get things that deal with your career and finances and, you know what I mean? But, I mean... For us starting out, I'm going to go ahead and just do what comes out for today. But moving forward, I'm just trying to give you all a picture of the outline of what I plan on doing. The bottom of the deck, we have your, your and your energy, the Five of Swords. Who are you planning on taking revenge on, uh, Aquarius? I'm saying revenge. Um, somebody here is embarrassed of you all's connection, okay? So somebody's embarrassed of you all's connection. Um, somebody here could be plotting revenge. I don't know if this is you. Okay. Uh, somebody is getting ready to make some sort of emotional move. Okay. So let's see what's going on with you. Uh, Aqua. What do you have for Aqua? Aqua. Ten of Cups. Could be a family situation, okay? I heard painting pictures, so like making something look good. All right, there's you could want to reach out to someone, or you're taking a break from someone. Ten of Swords. Ooh. This could be family as well with the Ten of Cups. Some sort of betrayal. Ace of Swords. Ten of Cups. What is the Ten of Cups here? Could be someone you have children with. Take it how it resonates for you. Ten of Cups. Or Aquarius. Ten of Cups. Please and thank you. Ten of Cups. All right, we have the Lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini that's like family, or you have a family with a Gemini. So I can resonate. Or Gemini was making you happy or made you happy at some point. Let's see. What is the Knight of Wands? All right, Knight of Swords, King of Cups. All right, so, uh, could have this been you that did something emotional, Aquarius? Confirmation. So, you, you, you said something or did something out of you being in your emotions. Um, you could have been split, all right? You could be feeling emotions for two people, I'm saying here. Yeah, there's a decision that I feel like maybe that you need to make between lovers. You're watching someone. You're, you're definitely keeping tabs on someone. Someone could have blocked someone here. Okay. The four of. All right. We got the eight of swords and the high priestess with the empress here. Ooh. So, could be. For some of you, this could be a child's mother. This could be the way that you view someone here. This could be a mother. Okay. Could be your mother. I'm not sure. We're getting ready to clarify some stuff right quick. King of Wands. Okay. Hmm. With the sun. Could be dealing with a Leo. Leo could be significant here. All right. Let's see. Well, the Ten of Cups and the Lovers here for Aquarius. I do feel like for some of you, there's a decision you have to make. Your heart is torn in between two people. Some of you are wishing that you could have both. <laughs> Greedy fuckers. <laughs> yeah. Ten of Cups and the Lovers. 
forgiveness. They want to apologize for hurting you and hoping to start over if you forgive them next month. So this could be you. This could be your person. Okay. You take it. You know how your story went. You know how it goes. You know who needs to give the apology. Maybe both of you do. Okay. Give me the Knave of Wands, the Knight of Swords, and the King of Cups. Yeah, somebody did something out of emotion. I don't know if you thought you were suppressing it. But somebody said something because they were in their feelings. And it looked like this you, Aquarius. Because remember when I said that, I got confirmation. So, did you say or do something when you were in your feelings? All right. Okay. New love. Cut cords with old flames and clear the way for new love. Okay, so you could be thinking about someone from the past. Um, don't have the same awareness of the connection. Can't rush the process. And then the future is you. A future with you is all they think about. Expect some sort of, some kind of commitment and or serious offer. Huh. Family issues. Okay. Family responsibilities are holding them back. Maybe a marriage. Don't put your life on hold. So somebody here could be dealing with someone who... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Who uh, could already be in another situation here. Somebody could have a family. Someone they consider to be like a divine soulmate here. Yeah, dead end. You reached a dead end. Thank you. You reached a dead end. Choose to leave with dignity and strength and get unstuck in love. So, something is dead. I don't know what it is you're hoping to bring back, but this situation has come to a dead end. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now, I don't know if this is you or them, uh, Aquarius, but after much thought, they decided to be with you instead of their other option. But this could also be you. So you take it how it resonates in your story. You know, you flip it, twist it, reverse it, however you got to do it. All right. Somebody feels safer or feels better watching someone from a distance here. Four of Swords, Eight of Swords, High Priestess. Clear message, please. Four sword. Okay, thank you. New beginning. Somebody is hoping to get a connection off the ground here. Um, somebody here could somebody wants someone to know that they've changed. Give me more on this. You could be dealing with someone, a young air sign that's younger than you. New perception. Somebody doesn't see something in a new way, though. So someone could still have the same perspective. Okay, don't lose yourself in loving someone. Because that's what I'm getting here. Make sure you're not losing yourself. Sexual desires. Hmm. All right, so some of you, you may need to make somebody work for something here. Work for it, okay? Hmm. Let me see. What is this high priestess? No. Give me the ten of cups, the lovers, and forgiveness. Let's see what that's about. Five of pentacles in the reverse. Somebody want to come out of the cold. Wow, the emperor. Well, yeah, this definitely could be a marriage here. And we have the temperance. 
So there's some sort of, yeah, wow, with the lovers here again at the bottom. Um, there's some sort of like divine intervention here. There's something being worked out, okay, in the spirit realm that I don't feel like that you do not see. All right, it's going to take time and patience, and it's also taking healing to happen. We have the lovers here twice with the Ten of Cups. It's okay, it's mirroring. You and someone are mirroring one another. All right, we look, we have the King of Swords. So, this could be you, um, Aquarius, doing some sort of healing work, healing abandonment issues. Because you could have had dealt with some sort of family issues before, some sort of abandonment issues. Um, I feel like some, like, an ancestor or God is helping you move forward. Yeah, look at this. Especially even, too, in a work situation here, okay? There's some sort of new contract coming in. There's a new contract uh, that I feel like you and somebody are going getting ready to come together. Uh, or something here is blocked. Let's see, because then we got the nine of wands right here, so... I don't know if, uh, give me the, I don't know if you were working a bit too much. Cause I am seeing that somebody here could be a bit of a workaholic. Yeah. <laughs> Can't make it up. Somebody here could be a bit of a workaholic. Okay. And you put money, finances and things like that ahead of everything. And don't get me wrong. And your mind is logical, right? But I feel like if you display some sort of toxic trait to somebody, um, I feel like this person I feel like you could be in some sort of regret or them. Take it how it resonate. Okay. Uh, somebody could have already been in a connection or in a situation here. Three of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. Yeah. Ten of Pentacles. Wow. So, Corey, is that somebody you saw, like, baby, you felt as though you and them could have been happy boots. You saw some sort of, I don't know, like, you saw something with someone here. Okay, somebody could have been hard to open up. They may have been afraid to get hurt. This could be you. could be them. You take it how it resonates for you. But I feel like, I don't know, there's some sort of sexual chemistry between you and somebody. Last test. But somebody here feels like somebody here is irreplaceable. Somebody wants to clear the air. There were a lot of, uh, there was a lot left unsaid they can no longer hide the way they feel about you. Or you can no longer hide the way you feel about them. All right. Um, last test. Okay. So, I don't know if it's you that's still the same. Or them. It's a hard decision. Then I tell you two paths to choose. Both equally attractive for different reasons. You're stuck in indecision. So something is going to become clear to you when you stop obsessing over it um, and just allow your heart and head to meet as one and make a decision. Okay? Uh, I do feel like for some of you, you're feeling like you're being pulled in two directions. All right? Okay, Aqua. So hidden plans. Let's see. We have awakened. They have done the work and want to take a leap of faith for love in a few months. So somebody has been doing the work on themselves. Somebody's really been putting in the work on themselves. Bring newness. Angels blocking connection. There's someone better than who you have in mind. Somebody is not right for you. 
And I feel like it definitely, uh, I feel like it's whoever you're feeling like you have this strong pull to. Denial. Being in denial over the relationship ending is prolonging your own suffering. So it's time for you to let something go. Okay, uh, Aquarius. It's time for you to let something go. You holding on is what's, um, it's like you're basically taking the knife, the, uh, the knife. Look, I was about to get country. Somebody could be here, could be from the country. Um, somebody, it could be knives. Uh, you, it's like you taking a knife and stabbing yourself with it at this point, is what Spirit is saying. Um, and whoever this is, this person could be embarrassed of the connection, or you could have been embarrassed of the connection. I mean, you take it how it resonates, okay? I don't want a relationship right now. I'm still doing me. So somebody here is feeling like, ooh, look at this. I'm married. All right. We have I'm dating other people as well. And I'm trying to decide if this relationship is for me. Hmm. The only thing on my mind is sex. I never meant to hurt you. So I don't know if this is you or your person, uh, Aqua. Anything else that Aqua needs to know? But this person still wants to hold on to you. Interesting. Yeah, I want to lick you all over your body. I miss being intimate with you. Maybe we should just give this up. And at the bottom, I just want to protect you. I only have eyes for you. And I only want to protect you. Came back out again. All right, then we have I'll never trust you again. So there's a there, there's an issue of trust between you and someone here. Message in a bottle. So expect some sort of communication. All right. You may find out someone is pregnant as well with that stork being there. Serendipity, we have orphaned. All that glitters and gold. There's something you're doing, of course, that you're almost at the finish line. New life is in the reverse. Go to distance. Higher power. Why is it in the reverse? Why is new life in the reverse? Alright, there's a need for you to be flexible. Something is time for you. It's time for something to go. Something is not for you, Aquarius. I don't something's not for you. Something's not, yeah, but the, whoever this person is. You could have really felt like that you could have built something with someone here. But I feel like there's a lot of changes happening in your life, okay? We have the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody is coming in that I feel like you're going to share some sort of, um, that you're going to share some sort of, yeah, there's going to be some sort of equal give and take here, Okay. Yeah, some sort of illusion. Something here is over. Yeah, three of swords, the death. And then, but we have the devil right behind it. So it's something keeping you stuck. Something's keeping you stuck. Some sort of regret here. Some sort of regret. Give me not for you time to go. Seven of swords. Not for you, time to go. Ooh, okay, too many. Not for you, time to go. 
all right we have the sun something is about to become clear all right we have the queen of swords here so you could be dealing with another gemini libra aquarius or this could be you take it how it resonate something is coming out or well, some sort of clarity what is the sun why is the sun here for not for you and time to go why is the sun here why is the sun here the time to go and not for you page of wands six of cups yeah something is blocked here what is that nine of wands the chariot three of swords Ace of Wands, the Chariot. Yeah, some sort of aha moment. Six of Wands, Ace of Cups. Four of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Something here is going to lead to, I don't know, you could be saving, you and someone could be saving to move in together, okay? You could be getting ready to offer someone your cup, all right? Wanting to, wanting to hold on to someone. You could be closing out some sort of a cycle here. So maybe you are closing it out with the past. All right. Um, why is the Eight of Swords here? Why are you sewing your head? Let's see. What's cross? Justice. Something is not fully balanced here. Something with a Libra and a Leo as well. What is this? Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so you could be planning on making someone an offer or expressing how you feel about someone here. Queen of Swords, Seven of Pentacles. And the King of Cups. Is somebody here you want to invest in? <coughs> Excuse me. Seven of Pentacles. Well, you and someone could have been waiting. Yeah, going back and forth. Not once you, I feel like for some of you, uh, especially if you're masculine, I felt like at some point you were open emotionally, okay? And uh, I feel like once you decided to become open emotionally, somebody else went cold, all right? But it could have been because of some sort of conflict. Somebody here could have been in a relationship or some sort of commitment already, okay? Ooh, I wanted to come on the reverse. Oh. So hold on, you and this person, okay. So you and this person, either somebody never apologized to the other person about something that took place between you two, or you and this person never went out on a date. I could see that too. Nine of Pentacles and a half. with the hermit and the seven of wands something ooh, okay yeah something is definitely finito something is finito
Somebody could have been a little immature when it came to love. Or whoever this queen of swords, they put up some sort of boundary because maybe you were entertaining someone else as well. They could have thought you were emotionally immature, but... Mm. Page of Pentacles, yeah. Somebody here is in regret. Wanting to make some sort of amends here. We have a star. Ten of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. And the lovers here again. Why is the devil here? Why is the devil here? Seven of Swords. Two of Cups. Cross. Why is the Two of Cups cross? Six of Pentacles on the reverse, Eight of Cups, Ace of Swords. So you could have felt like you had to walk away from someone or this, whatever this lover is, the situation. Um, there could have been something very toxic about you all's dynamic. There was no equal give and take. Uh, whatever this is, is like y'all were in limbo. You know how people, they don't necessarily put a title on something. It's just... There's a mutual love, mutual respect, mutual, like, there's mutual energy here, but there was no title. It was more like a situationship type thing. You may find out someone is pregnant or expecting... We have by the book here. Mending. So I do feel like you want to mend something with someone here. You want another go. <laughs> you feel like you 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 want to be ready this time. Uh awkward. I feel like whatever this is. <laughs> you want another go with this. I mean. Deep knowing Treasure Island. A leg up. You don't you don't want to let something go here. Especially because I only have eyes for you. You feel like you want to make it to the finish line. Uh you and someone can co-create something together. Alright. Y'all commend whatever it is that happened between you two. Hey, I just get the messages, baby. I ain't here to judge. That ain't my business. Okay. That is not my business, but I'm just telling you what I <sighs> what I see. All right, let's see what would the next phase be for you and this person. If Aquarius was to give this another go, wow, somebody here has some dark obsessions. What else? Oh damn! Fuck you. <laughs> okay. Somebody has let a situation go over. Damn. So, ooh, Aquarius. What is going on? Temptations. Ooh, this person is a temptation for you. Mm-hmm. Come through. I got my hooks in you. So, somebody feels like, oh, they got you rap, baby. See, I only get meant to get my feet wet, so... You only meant to just have someone here as just like a, I don't know. Yeah. You just meant to have somebody here who, you know, y'all was supposed to just have a little fun here and there. But somewhere down the line or somewhere lost in translation, feelings got involved. So you might want to tell this person, yeah, someone from your past. You might want to tell somebody here, come through, come see me. Mm. 
I'm hanging Contagious by the Osley Brothers. Give me what you got. Drive me crazy, sexy lady. Mm -mm. I should have gave you flowers. Is this how you feeling, Aquarius? You don't feel as though you gave this person their flowers when you when y'all were dealing with one another. Like I said, I feel like a mirroring. If you only knew. So if somebody only knew how much you cared for them, as well as maybe you didn't know how much they cared for you. Is what I'm seeing here. You may not have known how much they cared about you. We have, I got your back, baby. Walking away, those crossed. Hanging on, it's crossed. Thinking about it is cross. Somebody here is drinking. Somebody can drink dark liquor. I put a spell on you. Interesting. Look at this unwanted pregnancy. I told you. Might here. It might be a shock. Somebody may be pregnant. Yeah, I should have gave you your flowers. That could be you saying that or this person. If somebody said they should have given their flowers. This came out crawl, so I feel like you don't you, you don't know how you really feel about this situation. Like one minute, it's like you're going through extremes I'm feeling like here. Secret animosity. So it's like you had, ooh. <laughs> I'm just getting this in reflection. I need some time away, shattered man. Okay, I'm ready for it all. So, um, Aquarius. I feel like somebody's outlook on love was a bit distorted. Or there's like some sort of, it could be like, I'm feeling like a cultural difference or it's something to where it's though, like it stemmed from something of why you and someone kind of like, like I'm seeing like a, a some sort of like soulmate energy, but it's more so given what is the confliction like it's like you and this person is y'all battle yourselves internally but there's something that draws you two together mind-blowing sex please don't go okay oh somebody to lock somebody down look at this insatiable appetite okay so you and somebody have some crazy sexual type chemistry going on here. I need to know. It's in the reverse and worth it. And we have emotional manipulation. So you can feel like this person can be emotionally manipulative. Well, somebody may try to. Somebody may try to guilt trip you and telling you that they're pregnant. Be mindful of snakes. Unnecessary drama, which is cross. Anything else? Nice and slow. There's some good news coming. Oh, I'm giving you 24 hours. Can we fall in love? That's the way I feel about you. Mmm. I don't know. I feel like for some of you, of course, you some for somebody here, you're ready to rush in. Um, like somebody dark thoughts is telling them to say fuck somebody here. Like 
fuck you, right? <laughs> Somebody's dark side is like, fuck her, fuck him. But in all actuality, there's a lot of love underneath. <laughs> like, honestly, it's a lot of love underneath. Ooh. Hmm. On the outside looking in. I don't know. You could feel like this person is doing black magic or they feel like you are. You know, black magic does not have to do with, uh, you know, hocus pocus all the time. It could just be your words, things that you manifest. Yeah, look, yes, please don't go. All right, let's see. How does, uh, I want to see how this person feel about you, Aquarius. And then what are your feelings towards this person? We have here I stand. So I feel like you're about to present yourself to someone here. There's definitely someone that you're supposed to be uh, walking away from. Alright, let's see. Look at this. Queen of Cups. King of Cups. So, Joan, whoever this is, you and them... Y'all are manifesting each other, acting like you're not. It is some weird shit going on here. How does Aquarius feel about this person? How does Aquarius feel about this person? Okay, two of wands in the reverse with the two of swords. You're trying to block them out. Two of wands reverse. Two of Wands reverse. <laughs> Aqua, what you got going on? You don't, you're don't. you unsure of what the future will hold between you two, so you just rather not face it. You feel some sort of remorse, some sort of regret. Give me some more. Please don't leave. Queen of Pentacles. The Tower. The Hermit. Oh, it look like it's another card. Oh, no, it's one card. Let's see. Four pentacles. You're holding on to a queen of pentacles energy. You need a four of... Well, you feel possessive over this queen of pentacles energy. What is the four of pentacles? The sun. Whether you admit it to yourself, you don't want someone to leave. You see someone is like your end all be all. There would be something or something. Yeah, there would be something somebody would have to walk away from. Give me the sun. I'm working on my patience. I had to pacify him or her. Hold on, I had sex with them to pacify him or her. You inspire me. 
You triggered me. I don't like your friends. I don't like your family. Process of separation or divorce. So somebody here um, could be in separation or divorce. Somebody could be focused on their kids. Okay. Um, we have give me some space. So you want some space. Sometimes I sit alone and think of you. That's in the reverse. I get nervous around you. So you, this person makes you nervous. And lately I've been getting a weird vibe from you. Okay. Now let's see how this person feel about you, Aqua. Let's see how they feel about you. Well, it looks like you might actually still get your hour anyway, Arthur. Oh. Let this person feel about Aquarius. This person feel about Aquarius. Believe it or not, whether you think they do or they don't, they think about you. Hmm. They feel like, oh, okay. They feel like you don't, you didn't give anything to the connection besides sex. Like they felt like that's all you wanted. I'm hearing fair exchange, no robbery. Like, I don't know. Like I said, you and whoever this is, y'all were mirroring one another. Look, two of cups. That y'all, there was no, there was no effort put in. And I feel like it's on both sides, though. Like I said, I feel like with, you know, and if it's a Gemini, one thing about a Gemini, oh. One thing about a Gemini, they're going to mirror back to you what you're giving. So, if you are loving them at 110%, they're going to love you back at 110%. Uh, mm, nine of Cups reverse. So, you felt as though you didn't... They, okay, so, is sexually something that... Because that's what I'm getting. What is the tower? Ten of Swords. So, did they say that, you know, they wasn't fulfilled sexually? I mean, it should look like you staying that attention to me. This person was, they, they, they blocked their feelings for you, Aquarius. Could be dealing with a water sign here for some of you. But this person, blocked, they have emotions and feelings for you. They block it. Why? Look, and here go the lovers, the world, the empress, with the high priestess. Oh no, that's the two of wands, sorry. Empress, two of wands, page of pentacles. You look at this person as your empress. Or you can have a child with them, I don't know, for some of you. This person, yeah, they really try to block their feelings. Whoever this is, they play hardball, but they love deeply. Crazy. This could be somebody who's uh, very stable. Could have dealt with some sort of heartaches that they needed to deal with as well. Get their confidence back up. Look at the lovers wanting to pop out again. I can't make it up. Y'all feel the same way about each other. You see them as your empress. They see you as this emperor. They could have always felt like you like being single. You wanted to stay single. 
I'm not going to lie to you. Somebody could be holding on to someone. Somebody could feel like somebody's trying to hold on to uh, their child's father. Or, oh, somebody could feel like they miss their child's father. Or holding on too tight. Or, hmm. Could be saying 44. And then we have the devil and the two of cups. There was something you and this person are supposed to learn from each other. <coughs> what do I learn? What, what do I do? Thank you, confirmation. No, yeah, there's something y'all was supposed to learn from one another. Give me uh this four pentacles, four cups. You can be saying 44. Hypnotize. Hard to resist. You and this person were obsessed. Y'all was obsessed with each other. Or you are obsessed with each other. Like it's something. Child, y'all fighting it. Y'all feel like home to one another. Honestly. Y'all really feel like home to one another. You and somebody are fighting. Y'all emotions. Something wicked. And I don't know if y'all bringing other people into the situation. Okay, um, some of you, this could have been a spiritual marriage. Like, you may not be married to this person in the physical, but maybe I feel like somewhere along the lines, like, y'all have some sort of spiritual thing going on here. Hot and cold. Y'all both send each other mixed signals. Forbidden fruit. Desire but dangerous, not socially acceptable. Okay, tempting and alluring. So... Hmm. star renewed hope doing the healing work that's your energy uh, Aquarius and we have mental prison thinking of you a lot so you're thinking about them as well as them thinking about you y'all are both in your heads about this separation okay um, not gonna lie to you there could be a new person coming in for you okay relationship broke down you've been in your head about this since whatever this separation between you two both of y'all were heartbroken whatever you think that you were feeling and you were by yourself or alone in it you were not you and this person are feeling the exact same thing secretly stalking so y'all both watch each other Again, y'all both feel as though y'all took the other one for granted. Y'all both, y'all more, y'all are mirroring one another, and y'all felt like true loves. What the fuck is going on? Both of y'all, y'all feel like y'all are haunted by each other. What the? Aquarius, give me habitual liar. Habitual liar. Habitual liar. Knight of Swords in the reverse. Somebody was real reckless with their mouth. And earlier it came out that it was you, Aquarius. You were reckless. You were reckless. I don't know. You wanted to win at something. You wanted to stand your ground, and you wanted to win. So it was by any means necessary. By any I can't make the shit up. Ace of Swords. What I'm telling you is the truth. By any means necessary, okay? But I feel like you felt foolish. After whatever you did or said, you felt foolish. This person you look at as your soulmate. This person could be a bit unconventional, okay? <laughs> Whoever this is, they could have like a gypsy type attitude, all right? But this is somebody you see as your dream girl, dream guy, and vice versa. It was some sort of bond or connection you two had. And I just feel like, yeah, divine intervention. There's a lot of regret here. Somebody regrets running. Somebody wants to undo the damage. But didn't I say avoiding connection? 
jealousy. But there's someone who wants you for themselves. Something will be very surface. All right, we have the Queen of Cups. Here, risk, taking a risk. Somebody want, okay. So maybe the runner no longer wants to run or the chaser no longer. It's something of that nature. Needing confirmation, searching for answers. Be vigilant, because somebody may not have, okay. Yeah, somebody see somebody here. Yeah, somebody could have had a child that they didn't want. We have spotlight here. Toxic depression. Prolonged grief, I'm telling you. And somebody was feeling very pessimistic about a situation, but we have mirroring. I told you, mirroring each other, something needs healing, seeing yourself in them, cleaning up life, cutting out negativity. So some sort of negativity, some is people, something, something had to go. We had the main lady. Something had to go. True love, waiting, protection. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm to get a couple of these. Let's see what this says. One thing about these, they gonna give me the truth too. Help you put it in some sort of perspective. Like I say, y'all, whoever this is, you and this person mirroring each other like crazy. This is real love. Whether y'all want to admit it to your fucking selves or not. Y'all mirror one another. All right, we have new love. Someone new is coming towards you. Engagement, things are going to the next level. So you may end up getting engaged. Space. Someone wants space to give it time. marriage in the reverse this connection is leading towards sharing the same last name but it's in the reverse at the bottom we have forgive let the past go so that you can have a fresh start and then we have intimacy do not shame your wants and desires hmm. give me more this is cross forgive forgive so you want to forgive something, but you don't know if you can. This is a soulmate connection. Reality check. Your relationship expectations are not realistic. So did you want somebody to totally give to you when you weren't willing to give the same thing in return, Aquarius? Confirmation. Um... <laughs> I'm a commitment. You can expect this commit this connection to last long term. Boys, your want for love is allowing you to settle and accept anything. So do you know that something is not exactly what you want, but you're willing to go with it because that's what I mean, that's who, you know, that's who you have in front of you. That's the energy I'm getting off of that. No lie. That's the energy I'm getting off of that. Confirmation again. So like a space. You're, you know, what if you get back with whoever this person is, um, I feel as though whether it's this person <clears throat> that you feel as though you have this strong connection with or if it's a new person, awkward, your advice, you're going to have to allow yourself to be vulnerable or otherwise you're going to repeat the same cycle, I feel. Um, somebody like you, they just don't know how to tell you. 
I told you, you and somebody, y'all both have a lot of emotions for one another. And I feel like you and them, you, you know, y'all never expressed it. This is like something being suppressed. Like, I'm feeling like this, there's like not a little bit. You know what I mean? It's like a knot. Like, whatever this is, see, please don't leave me. Clear answer, please. I keep having dreams about you. Why are you so cold towards me? Okay. I've really been praying about us. I don't want to hide our connection anymore. I had sex with him or her to pacify them. I watch and stalk your social media. Somebody here could want custody of their child or their children. I'm obsessed with you. I don't like your friends. I always feel so lonely without you. I keep having dreams about you. Somebody here is saying that they're just staying for the kids, okay? And somebody say, let's go into business together. Well, somebody could want to build like a Ten of Pentacles, or maybe you want to build some sort of Ten of Pentacles with this person. You take it how I resonate for you. Uncle, uh, we got a little warm. It must, have, must have warmed up outside. All right, let's get you some uh, Oracle and get your other little messages right quick. I was trying to keep you under 60, but yeah, look, you inspire me. Somebody don't want to hide y'all no more. Somebody ready to be on Front Street. Sometimes I sit alone and think of you. I get nervous around you. I have a secret, but I don't know how to tell you. Oh, boy. Okay. And, uh... I don't know who this is for, but somebody here could be into same-sex relationship. Take it how I resonate for you, baby. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Just giving the message, babe. Just giving the message. Let's see. Who is it that Aquarius is time for them to go? Who is it that Aquarius is time... For them to go is not for them. Who is this? Too many. Simplify the message, please. All right. I feel like it's anything that's... Okay, we have the Emperor. We have the King of Rods. Interesting. Okay. Two masculine energies. Ace of Swords. Queen of Rods. High Priestess. And the Ten of Wands. And we have the Strength. Maybe something here with the Leo. Ace of Swords. Judgment. Okay. Some sort of truth. Could be a Leo. Yeah, somebody weighs you down. Somebody could be a bit overbearing as well. Somebody could not know how to balance their masculine and feminine. Okay, I'm seeing that as well. Yeah, somebody having an issue balancing. Yeah. And this person could be like keeping something here in limbo. 
Yeah. With the strength. This is someone, either they rejected you or they miss you. Or you miss them. Feel like you missed the opportunity with them. Yeah, you want to reconcile. Like I said, whoever this is, you feel like, baby, look, they feel like your empress, you feel like their emperor, or vice versa. Take it out and resonate. Y'all both been wore down by this. Tower of the Devil. Page of Pentacles. I feel like, too, by the time somebody was ready to open up, somebody walked away. If somebody was ready to express their love, somebody walked away. Or somebody could express their love and you still plan on walking away. I don't know. It's like, I resonate. I need to eat me some food. That muffin ain't cut it. I'm going to get you some prophecies and... Uh, Yeah, whoever this is, though, you miss this person sexually. They miss you, too. Like I say, it's something about y'all's sexual chemistry. I don't know. But you and this person mirror each other. ahead of you, uh, Uncle. Aquarius, please and thank you. Your next three, Aqua, I'm going to do your lies and, lies and truths. What lies and truths do you need to know? All right, but we're going to... All right. The prophecy is for Aquarius, please. Aquarius need to know. Aquarius need to know. Oh, beautiful word the first. You ain't want to say much or nothing. All right, we're going to leave it right there. <coughs> Excuse me, the bottom of the deck. Your personal difficulties will soon improve within an intimate relationship. Someone who you wouldn't expect will make it known that they have feelings for you. Someone who is destined to be in your life will soon enter if you make room by clearing out the energy of another who is no longer suited for you and the expectation that they will change. Create the change you desire. Tensions and hostilities may arise at the time. You can prevent this by withdrawing your energy and spending some time in solitude. Within this year, there will be a reconciliation with someone from your past. 
a profound time of healing approaches. It may feel challenging, but you will come out stronger than ever. You will soon embark upon a creative project that will enrich your life and benefit you in prosperous ways. Your beliefs may be challenged shortly as you find yourself in a period of transformation. What you believe to be the correct path for you may now not be so clear. I ain't gonna lie to you. Jim and I had a lot of these cards. Um, tap into your intuition and be aware of the people around you at this time. Someone is not who they portray themselves to be. You will be entering a transitional phase in which you may feel restless. Things may seem complicated at this time, but these changes are needed to help you move forward on your journey. News of a pregnancy will come. A time of travel is near. Enjoy this time, enjoy this time and leave your worries behind. Your personal difficulties will soon improve within an intimate relationship in your life. A challenging situation within family will be resolved. Okay. Um, ooh, okay. We also have the loss of a loved one will be inevitable. Spirit will send you supportive energies at this time. Ooh. All right. Uh, Aquarius, let me just give you an affirmation, a word of encouragement to close out. angels of healing a time of healing is about to bless your life accept archangel raphael's emerald green light while i enhance your strength the trust the guidance you're receiving so trust is reading uh aquarius so we have archangel uriel has blessed you with a brilliant epiphany i am also present to clear your way of worries so you can trust your divine guidance. Prioritize self-care. You do so much for others. It's time for you to experience the love you deserve and let others help you. Your loved ones are safe. Let go of your fear and worry for your loved ones. I am looking after them. Look at that. That says Gem that's the two. Gemini energy again. Um, hmm. Open your heart. No one is perfect. Stop judging yourself and others. And let love heal this situation. Okay? And then one more. Let's see. One more, please and thank you. Mm. I'm not taking these in the reverse. One more. Welcome abundance into your life. Welcome abundance into your life. Prosperity is on its way to you. Have faith that source will heal your financial challenges. Get your power back. You have forgotten who you are. You are a child of the divine. So take back your power. Some of you could be dealing with a Pisces. Pisces, I believe, had that. Had that card. So I hope these messages resonate. Please hit that like, share, subscribe button. And I will see you guys and gals in the next one. I appreciate you all. And I hope you enjoyed the reading. Yeah, it came out twice. So something, uh, something creatively you need to put into action, okay? And trust in divine purpose, all right? You are on a path of growth. So it's going to feel out of, you know, you're going to possibly feel a little out of sorts. But this could be a time where you need to increase your knowledge in something creatively, all right? Use this downtime to use it wisely. But again, thank you all so much. And I'll see you in your next one. Peace.